A rough winter is adding a bit of insult to injury for some people around the area. If 68 inches of snow and an average temperature of about 10 degrees for December, January, and February weren't enough, as the frost leaves the ground, some main water pipes are now breaking. Fox 11's Gabrielle May is joining us live from the east side of Green Bay, where a crew's been fixing one of those main lines today. Gabrielle? Yeah, we're on Brutco Drive, and it's not much to see now because they've actually already patched it up. The crews are over and done with that, and they pretty much fixed it. But this, I spoke with the, the city earlier today, and they said that it's just one of many. And we're probably at, the, for a winter season, we're at twice what we usually have right now. Paul Pavlik works for the city's water utility. He says around 240 water mains have been replaced or repaired within Green Bay. And with a staff of just 14 workers, the city had to ask for extra help. We were busier and obviously uh, we're not staffed fully for that, so we had to use outside contractors to come in and help. Uh, this is a very unusual year for us. It can cost the city anywhere between $1,500 and $7,000 to fix a broken pipe. But the city says the cost could increase depending on how bad the break is and its location. One of the most common signs of a break is when you see water on the ground surface. But in this case, the people living in this area say that they notice low water pressure and they called the city. The city isn't the only one picking up the tab. If a pipe breaks on your property, you'll have to pay for the repairs. That can cost $1,500 or more depending on the type of damage. But the city says that type of break is very uncommon. It's not as common as broken mains. Uh, we probably, during a normal year, maybe have a couple of dozen owners, what we call owner's leaks, and that's out of uh, 36,000. In De Pere, the city says close to 100 homes have been dealing with water freezing inside the pipes. That could lead to more repairs as temperatures start to rise. Some of them we had to have a temporary connection because we couldn't unthaw. So we're anticipating some of those laterals may be, you know, broke uh, through the course of the winter. But until the frost is out of the ground and the things warm up, we won't know. When it comes to fixing a water main break, it can take anywhere between um, six and four, uh, four to six hours. And that's only if the workers don't run into any problems when they're actually fixing the pipes. Reporting live in Green Bay, Gabrielle Mays, Fox 11 News.